This video will demonstrate how to add products to an existing six project. Uh, first thing you want to do is open up the project file. You can do that by double clicking the project file you want to open or click the project editor button here in the ribbon. This will launch the project editor for this particular project. And uh, there's a few ways that you can add uh, products to a uh, project file. Uh, one way here is the add products button. Go ahead and click that. And this pulls up your list of uh, products that you have in your catalog. And down here you can see the locations and the systems that you've set up for this project. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and search for projects and look for something very specific. And uh, it found the piece I'm looking for, so I'm going to select it. I'm going to choose the location where it's going to be actually installed. In this case, it's actually going to the equipment room, part of home theater. Hit Add and Close. You can see that the product has now been added to the grid here. Uh, there's another way that you can add uh, products as well, and that would be the Product Explorer over here. Now, uh, again, this video is focusing on products, but you can also add uh, labor items or packages at any point you want to a uh, project file. In this case, I'm going to select my location over here in the drop zone and uh, choose my system. And I'll go ahead and pull this uh, Product Explorer uh, interface out. You can uh, you know, pin that down if you'd like. And I'm going to do a quick search for what I'm looking for. And once you find the uh, product that you want to add, like say this, I'm going to go ahead and put, let me just see here, seven of these. And uh, you can change the quantity on a per line basis and then just drag the product over here and choose to add those to the project. Uh, this particular product has accessories, and in this case a wire, and right now I'm being prompted to see if I want to add that wire. I'll go ahead and do that. And now, since this was a bulk wire, it's asking me for the head end and the length so it can charge properly for the uh, price of the wire. In this case, I'm going to choose just the uh, audio head end and we'll say that they're going to estimate 100 feet. We'll go ahead and assign those. And as you can see, the products are now here added. I'll go ahead and click that so it uh, undocks. And then you just continue on adding products to the job until you've uh, spec'd out the entire system or systems.